Here are the five stories you must read in this issue of Forbes magazine. Number one, our, our cover story on Pinterest. Uh, Facebook and Twitter get a lot of attention and they're sort of about keeping up with your friends and sharing news. But Pinterest, on the other hand, can identify what you might do or buy in the future. And that's a business model that's worth some $5 billion and has no less than Google in its sights. Number two, what did Dr. Seuss Bob Marley and Betty Page all have in common? They're all on our annual list of the 13 top earning dead celebrities. Number one on this list this year is Michael Jackson, who earned $140 million despite being dead. Number three, you should check out our list of America's top 50 small companies. These are the 50 best small companies in America, ranked on things uh, like five-year sales growth and five-year earnings per share growth. If you're an investor, these are 50 companies you should definitely consider for your portfolio. Number four, do you make more than $200,000 a year? If you do, you should stop everything you're doing right now and read our story on the Roth Road to Riches. This is a new trick allowed by IRS rules that'll prevent you from paying unnecessary taxes in your retirement. And finally, the Waldorf story that just sold to a Chinese insurance conglomerate for $2 billion. This is just the latest episode in the most storied hotel in the entire world. We trace its history back 121 years, back to when Waldorf and his cousin Astor built the Waldorf Waldorf and the Astoria, which were collectively known as the hyphen by New York City's elite. And those are the five stories you should read in this issue of Forbes magazine.